think Monte's an all-star this year? I think you can talk about him just like any other guard in, uh, in the West. Does that mean anything to you guys to, to have an all-star for the first time? In well, he hasn't made it yet. Right, right. You can't if, count him on Billy. If, if he was, would that mean something to you guys, or do you, do you even consider it's a, like you that? Know, to me, all it means is that uh, it's a nice thing for it's an individual accomplishment. He seems to to shoot more three pointers this year than he has in the past. Is that something you'd like to see his his game expand to? Uh, you know, it, it, I leave it totally up to him. I I don't put any restrictions on Monte. It depends on his percentage, you know. If, if I think he's got a decent percentage on threes. Well, it's in the 40s, isn't it? Would you say he has a lot of freedom on the offensive end? I'd say so. <laughs> what would you say? I'd say that he had a lot. Um, a couple, couple good practices back to back. Seems like there's a, a little enthusiasm. Yeah, today was good because we had the big guys and they did a, a full practice. Uh, so it's exciting for everybody. You still consider yourself day to day, or do you have a, a time? To oh! I, I don't know. What does he say on the on the on the medical thing? Because I mean, yeah, day to day, day, day. I mean, this is I mean, this is not a funny situation to be. In. Uh, it's very it's very frustrating. Uh, it's a long process and. Uh, I'm just trying to do whatever I can to get back out there in the basketball court. And uh, if you saw the amount of work that I put in to get myself where I am right now, you'd be like, man, I, can't, I don't understand why you're not out there early. It's, it's, it's frustrating, so uh, I'm, taking, I'm definitely taking it one day at a time, that's for sure. Still looking at about a week or so, just get yourself acclimated? Uh, probably, probably right after the Christmas, we'll be ready. I just need a couple more for, like practices like these with a team, and uh, we'll go from there. How tough has it been to uh, sit out? It's been hard, it's been hard. And uh, especially when you see that, you know, we're kind of struggling with the rebounding and uh, and uh, defending people in the in uh, paint. So I'm anxious to get back and help my team. A lot of pressure on you since everyone's saying, oh, they're without their three centers? Um, not really. I mean, a little bit. I mean, it's, uh, it's kind of hard to, like you said, everybody, the centers is out. But at the same time, I don't want to rush it and come back and re injured in it. And, then I might be out for more time than I was now. So one week, one week extra, we'll, we'll, we'll do it. You're a captain on this team. What have you been giving the team off the court since you haven't been able to be with them on the court? I just have to talk and uh, you know help them out. If sometimes they struggle at the game or they're down because we lost. Just be, you have to be local and just talk to them, especially young guys, to so not get so hard on themselves and just play play every game. One of those young guys is Anthony Randolph. Uh, can you share anything specific or general that you've been kind of telling him? Yeah, you know, I was always telling him to just go out, and he's always, like, really sensitive, and he's getting frustrated for, like, you know, sometimes if you make a mistake, don't get so, like, disappointed to yourself, and then you're down, then your team goes down. So you have to kind of control a little bit the emotion. You've been pretty good about uh, setting team goals instead of individual goals. Do you see what it would mean to the Warriors if they were an All-Star? I think it means more we had a winning season than me being an All-Star. Uh -huh. So, uh, like I said, it's nothing you know, I'm really focusing on. Uh, I'm just trying to do whatever I can to help us win. There's a, a sheet here with quotes from players around the league about, about what they're saying about you and not how you respect it around the league. Does that mean something to you that the opponents are recognizing what you're doing? It is. Uh, it's just that. Uh, you know, since my rookie year up until now, all my hard work that I've done paid off. And, uh, you know, uh, being around the game in five years and learning from, you know, those guys who you got your comments from. And, I mean, just, that's the whole thing. It's an honor, but, uh, you know, uh, like I said, hard work pays off. Yeah, perfect. Thanks. Mm -hmm. I just have one question. Unless I'm mistaken, you seem to be in the post a little bit more last game. Is that a conscious effort to try to get down there and show your quickness? Oh, uh, it's something uh, we think is is a good thing for us. Uh, I can do a lot of things down there, take my man off the dribble, um, back him down, uh, make plays for others. So, you know I mean, I think it's a good thing for us. And uh, you know, so far, you know, I've been successful down there. 
Was that you going to coach saying, hey, I think I can go down low? Or they? Uh, that's something they, they did on their own. They uh, believed in me of getting down there and doing the work that I needed to do, and uh, I've been doing it.